हेलो एवरी वन दिस प्रॉब्लम हैज बीन आस्ट इन गेट 2016 सेशन वन एंड इट इज फ्रॉम द पावर सिस्टम सब्जेक्ट सेशन वन एंड दिस प्रॉब्लम इज फ्रॉम पावर सिस्टम सब्जेक्ट एंड इट इज ऑफ वन मार्क so let us see the what the question says the magnitude of three phase fault currents at bus buses a and b of a power system are 10 per unit per unit and 8 per unit respectively neglect all resistances in the system and consider the free fault system to be unloaded the free fault voltage at all bus in the system is 1.0 per unit the voltage magnitude at bus b during the three phase fault at bus a is 0.8 per unit The voltage magnitude at bus during three phase fault at bus B in per unit is. So it is a very simple problem, and if you want to have a detailed concept behind this problem, you can kindly refer this NPT lecture three phase fault studies, and the NPT course name is Power System Analysis by Professor Dev Priya Das, Department of Electrical Engineering, IIT Kharagpur, and the YouTube link is also shown over here. Now. let us come to the one of the simple expression that we we are going to use to solve this problem in this uh, we have to first like uh, but uh, we have to assume some uh, some things uh, so that we can apply this expression so here we have assumed that no load is connected in the system no current will flow before fault and all the buses are the same and equal to the pre fault voltage so we can find the post fault post fault voltage at the bus i using this expression having this line impedance is given that is connected between the fault bus and the where the we are finding the where we are finding the uh, voltage at the bus so let us solve this problem so what are things given given voltage at bus b after three phase fault at bus a is given as 0.8 per unit so, so we can write the expression the expression is for the post fault post fault voltage at bus b after three phase fault at bus a is we can write the expression so we can write vv post fault post fault voltage at bus b equal to pre fault voltage at bus b minus of impedances that are connected between a and b bus and the fault current a so if you want to write this in uh, schematic then you can write like this so let us take it as bus a and bus b so fault is happening at this bus and we are finding this voltage at bus b so this current will flow through like in this manner fault current a so just we apply this kvl and we will get this post fault voltage at bus b 
so this post fault voltage at bus is given as 0 0.8 per unit and this pre fault voltage is also given as 1.0 per unit minus jdb we have to find the impedance and fault current at bus is a and b power system are given as 10 per unit so on simplification it will give you 0 0.02 per unit now let us find the desired thing that it is asking in this problem that you have to find the post fault voltage at bus A after three phase fault that is symmetrical fault or balanced fault at bus B is so we are going to write the expression as the previous one VA post fault equal to VA peri fault minus ZAV fault current at the bus B so it is nothing but it is just the voltage difference delta V so in, in some of the textbook you can also find this expression in the delta V so if you want to write this in symmetric then you can make like this this is bus A bus B now in this case fault is happening at bus B so this current is flowing like this way IFV so just apply KVL you will get the post fault voltage at bus A VA post fault voltage at bus A pre fault voltage at bus A is 1.0 per unit JDB we have calculated in the previous expression and IF fault B is 8 per unit so you will get 1.0 minus 0 0.16 it will equal to 0 0.84 per unit this is the final answer so the correct answer for this problem is 0 0.84 per unit and the examiner has given it is in the range so they have given the range 0 0.83 to 0 0.85 per unit that's all thank you